Hello everyone, so in this video we have this vacuum cleaner that we have talked about in a previous review video. So, I want to upgrade now in this video the cells because it has like 2000 milliamp cells as it says on the sticker. But we want to add like some 3000 ones to have more working time with the vacuum cleaner. There are two more screws hidden underneath this uh, black cover here. I need to pry that. Side, yeah, it's gotten dirty with the use. So, that you can see inside, it only has a DC motor. I thought it was going to be brushless, but it's not. But anyhow, uh, it's pretty powerful. It has this mechanism here that sucks the air, it also blows it this way. So, what do we have here? It says here 18653. It's actually 12, 1200 million hours. I thought it was 2000. <laughs> this is even lower. So we're gonna get like double the, more than double, more than double the, the time. But it's hope so because sometimes these are uh, low capacity ones are actually some uh, high, uh, some high uh, discharge current. So we can handle uh, uh, like demanding loads pretty easily. So what are we gonna do is just we're gonna cut through this one here, and then we'll either put it back or do something else. Just see how the circuit is connected here first, and then we'll decide what to do. Okay. Keep that right in here, you might need it. Then, what do we have here? So yeah, we have the two blacks here connected to the negative, most negative. So these cells are in series. We have the most positives connected to the most positive. Okay, pretty straightforward. These should be connected together here. Yep. Right. So let's uh, keep these uh, wrapping paper. This one as well. And then we're just gonna remove these. And yep. Much it. Okay, I just made a short. Okay, I think we can still reuse this. Uh, this here. Now let's try and keep. Let move the one, the other one as well. In good shape. Okay, these are the original cells. They look cheap. So. We have our 3000 milliamp almost cells. I'm gonna grind the residue of the nickel strips in our angle grinder. Yep. Okay, here we are. Okay, so we have our cells grinded. I'm just going to connect them together. Okay. And then the negative should go to the positive. Uh, 
right. And then we have the most positive and most negative here. Let's measure. Uh, 6.9, so it's about 3.45 if it's uh, not fully charged, but uh, okay. So we can put this here on top of this. Yeah. Also, add this. Then I just need to straighten these and probably add them back. They have some material left here, so we can just solder them without, without trying to make the connections from scratch to the wires. Yeah, I think that will be better. Okay, here's our positive. There you go, they're connected. Let's go as they were. Like that. Let's try it. That is powerful and loud. I'm going to put back the wrapping here. Okay, so we've gathered the cells and put them in the original wrapping. We're just going to some tape to keep it together. Mm, that'll be it. Let's try once again. Yeah, that's pretty loud. It's only twisted the wires. And I just put everything back after doing some little bit of cleaning as it's gotten dusty in here. Okay, let's put everything in back in its place. This is a rubber seal here. Nice. Okay, I think we have to put this. Right? Well, let's put it. Okay, so put everything back together. It works fine. And it's powerful as ever. It's pretty powerful. So now it's supposed to take uh, much more time than it was before. I've tested it before and it gets empty so quickly with the uh, 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 continuous use. So now let's hope it gives us much better working time. Okay, here it is fully assembled. Let's give it a go with the with its head. Very great in the shoes. That's great. We're just gonna plug it in and fully charge it with its cable here. And in a future video, we might be integrating this inside and have a Type C port instead of this uh, battle battle jack that we have here. So we can uh, actually charge it the same way as we do charge other devices with one charger, one cable. Now that's pretty much it. Thank you for watching.